Hello to everyone, Denis Kozer here. In this video I want to show you how to model window. If you want more interesting videos, please subscribe on my channel, write some comments and give me likes. I search in the Google some window profiles and uh, here what we've got. As you can see, it all have some details not just a box with a glass so if you will model it like this it will look more realistic so I find some window profile and uh, let's create our own window so I create brand new plan and uh, let's give it the same size as we've got here so here will be 69 and here will be 100 centimeter I just drag and drop this image and the next thing I want it be much more realistic measurements so I create reference box and uh, make and make these sizes as we can see on the drawing so here will be 6 and 65 centimeter and here 7 and 5 okay next I put it here in the corner of my drawing and change pivot point to this corner. Next I just uh, press R key and uh, scale it so they matches just like that. As you can see it fits perfectly and now we can make this profile I just create these easy lines and uh, here is I want it to be a metal material so I will also make this detail in my profile after that we can easily set up the material in a few clicks so close the spline next we need some window frame so it will be rectangle I will create it bigger maybe like this and after that just apply sweep modifier next I use custom section and pick this profile as you can see now it's very sh sharp and uh, ugly so we need to match this drawing with this picture so I just want to make it more smoother and for that I will choose my vertex next I've got fillet tool and uh, here just round it up like this here also we can round it here maybe this and something like that okay good as you can see here 
it change also if you got you've got some ugly and um, result like that you just need to turn on these two and uh, after that we will create some easy and uh, simple material it will be multi sub object number of materials will be three and after that we need just three simple materials I use corona so we'll assign it here will be plastic rubber and the metal metal will be zero diffuse one reflection 10 IR and 78 glossiness rubber will be black reflection 1 glossiness 0 3 plastic will be semi white reflection 1 glossiness maybe 72 okay assign it and um, here it all as a white plastic but if I change the segments ID here this will be rubber okay so I change the ID to 2 next this part will be will be metal so I change ID to 3 and the other part is uh, plastic so when I change this here it's also changed here very useful tool so I hope it will be useful for you I just control V and uh, here choose copy delete sweep modifier apply edit poly and uh, shell here as you can see we've got our window but I want it only on the y-axis move and uh, here slightly little size and uh, as you can see if I drag it with the shift pressed button I can copy it as an instance and here we have different sizes so I just can change the size of this part and as you can see it also changes here and our window matches more as we want now I just create simple glass material diffuse 0 reflection 1 refraction 1 and assign it on these two objects and now if I will render it as you can see we've got this nice detailed window frame and I hope this video will be useful for you if you have some questions please ask me uh, in the comments and uh, give me a like or dislike if you appreciate this video see you next time bye